What's going on guys? My name is Tyson and today we're doing a quick review of the Bauer Supreme 175 ice pan. Um, this is a great pad. You have a nice advanced level protection while still getting the mobility you'd expect from the Supreme line. Um, taking a look at the exterior, slightly different exterior materials used on this one versus some of the lower models in the Bauer line. Um, starting on here, you have a more traditional nylons kind of across here, as well as the abrasion resistant materials across the lower portion of the legs, as well as seeing that same material again back up around the kidney guards and on this piece, as well as kind of down here and down the sides. Um, also on the front is you have your mesh material right here, increases that airflow, keeping the drying time as well as it being a little cooler. Um, you also have the same ribbed thigh guards. It is segmented right here, as you can see. So it's going to allow it to wrap around while giving you a nice mobility. It's not going to hold your leg movement back at all. Um, going on to the top portion, um, the padded belt cover, it's actually not covering the belt because the belt is running on the inside of the pad, as we'll take a look at when we look at the liner. But it does cover up if you're wearing suspenders and has kind of more of a classic look to it. They've gone ahead and stitched the Bauer logo on this piece as well as down here. Um, I really like that because as the pad gets worn, it doesn't has a nice kind of clean look to it even after it's been worn for a while. Um, going on to the back portion of it, you see it has a fairly similar design as the front. They've used a couple of different materials back here that they didn't actually use on the front. These are kind of a fine mesh material. They have a nice sturdy feel to it so it doesn't feel like it's going to rip but it is going to increase that airflow and keep you a little bit cooler. Um, they also have you know, a little bit of a thicker piece foam right here as far as compared to the 155. Um, it is segmented as well. It's not no plastic inserts, but it's going to give you a little more protection to some of those less frequently hit places. Um, going on, you have the same uh, stretch gusset running from up here. Starts narrow, then widens as you move around, and it'll come back to the front lace closure. You have the same leg stretch gussets, um, nice wide, as well as the zippers, which I'm always a fan on on the pants to open it up and add a little more width to it, as well as kind of has a little bit of a stretchy material here um, versus some of the more traditional ones, which kind of hugs a little bit and helps prevent sometimes hanging up on the shin guards. But then also on the backside is you do have some other stretch materials right here. So these are actually going to be running from your hip areas down kind of to the inseam. So that's going to help the mobility of the pad a little more. It's also, since it is a stretch material, it's almost like a fine mesh as well. So that's going to increase the airflow as well. Um, going on to the spine guard, it uses the hex absorb material. So this is going to absorb a lot of energy on impact, keeping your spine safe. It raises up off the rest of the pad, so it's going to close that gap between your shoulder pads and your ice pants. As well as going on to the sides, they use the same high density foams on the outside of the kidney guard and then softer foams on the inside. Um, this is going to do a nice job of adding that protection kind of below your shoulder pads again. Um, it's segmented in here in a couple places. This is going to help the overall mobility of it, allowing some pieces to stay closer to the body as you move in different directions. Um, and then going back to the front, um, you see the belt system. It's that same buckle that runs onto the inside with the pole cord that you can simply just tighten it down to get that fit you want as well as with a little foam on the belly guard. And then as we look onto the inside of the pad, um, you can see right here, this is actually where the belt runs on the inside. And that's a nice feature because it really allows you to get a nice tight feel on it. They use a Thermomax liner on it. That's going to be this blue material. It has a nice soft feel to it. It's one of my more favorite liners on the market. Um, and then it also runs down the tailbone area. Um, does have some print in there, as you can see. Um, that's going to you know, give you a little more texture to it. And then on the rest, this black region, it's kind of a fine mesh material again, which is not going to be as soft as the blue Thermomax, but it's still going to give you a nice solid fit. All right, so taking a look at the overall fit of the 175 ice pants, I think they've done a great job on these. You have a nice amount of protection in them, but it doesn't feel overly bulky on the sides. It stays kind of fairly close, but then again, not having too tight of a fit, so you really have that nice range of motion on it. Um, taking a look down here, you can see I've undone this zipper, so that gives you a look as far as how wide it would be if you have it opened. Um, this one, on the other hand, is closed, so it has a nice small form-fitting design. They have almost like a little bit of elastic, this very end piece on it, so it kind of allows it to tuck in a little more, gives it a nice fit. But with those segments in the pad, really allows for a great range of motion. 
Um, going up to the top portion, as you can see, the segments really allow it to wrap around the hip as far as the upper kidney area really nicely. Gives you some good protection there. Um, the closure system, like the other ones in the line, you have that internal belt strap. Like I said, I'm a big fan of tighten that up. If you like, you know, you can throw the string inside. This one, just simple draw cord and throw that inside too and you're ready to go. Um, overall, nice fit on these guys. This is the Bauer Supreme 175 Ice Pant here at Ice Warehouse.